It's been a while, hasn't it? How's it going, everyone? It's Marito here once again. I see chat's already blowing up. I hope you're all surviving in the post-apocalyptic wasteland because they banned going outside. I see well, Griff, of course, because I said I had I was going to have Griff on stream. Got Yoshi. Oh, come on. Sorry. Give me a moment. Peak professionalism, isn't it? <laughs> Sorry about that. Fucking perfect time for her to get home. Yeah. So we got Yoshi, we got Cabby, we got uh, we got Mew, we got Borb. We got a packed house tonight. Probably wondering where I've been the past two months, haven't you? And <laughs> professionalism is. Listen, we'll do it live. All right. This stream, there was there was no promise of quality in the first place. And there never will be, and I don't care. So, anyway, yeah. So, you probably wonder where I've been the past two months, and uh, the answer is no safety net, no safety net. The answer is uh, depression. I actually don't know how to describe it, but it just stopped being fun uh, because chat started to suck, but that's okay because I started to suck. I started to suck about four times as hard as you guys, so don't take it personally. This is all my fault, and I'd like to offer a sincere apology, except I don't. Uh, but I'm back now. Weather's really nice. Uh, got to finally get outside earlier, uh, even if it was only for like an hour and a half, and sitting in my older sister's car, who apparently watches these streams occasionally. Uh, fucking beats me. But yeah. So, got, uh, got the stream going. It's really nice out. I'm feeling good, and I have a guest, and I will bring him, uh, I will bring him in right away. Say hi, Griff. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I was, I was trying to time it. Hello, everybody. It's me. Uh, it's me, Griffbo. I am an incel from 4chan, and I like gaming. So, Griff. If you probably, yeah. if you remember the old uh, video remembered stream that we had, yeah, uh, I actually I've had Griff on in the past. He's uh he's he's pretty good. He's pretty good. Some people, you know, you get him on a stream on a hot mic and they go and they say nothing because they're scared. Uh, somebody needs to tell mom that we're going. I started early. That was a bad idea. I will never start early again because it's of course when I get interrupted. But I didn't I didn't I didn't want to just be sitting here waiting. You know, I wanted to I wanted to go because not only do I have a guest on, but I'm also going to be to ease back into it. I'm not going to be gaming the entire, you know, next couple of streams. I want to vary it up a little bit. But I am playing one of my favorite games of all time. Uh Half-Life 2 Deathmatch. Now, of course, some of you are probably immediately going Half-Life 2 had Deathmatch? And yes, it did. Nobody owns it and nobody plays it, but it exists. Yeah, there's a few servers. There's, there's a, a couple servers. Of, it's surprisingly still active. It's actually it's actually packed right now. I'd, I'd say at least. There's like a server with 18 people. 13, That's 11, cool. 10. That's not too bad. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty cool. So I figured Griff and I would just hop on some servers. We'd just play. We'd just talk a little bit about... Uh... Yeah, I'm going to like get in the voice chat a little. <clears throat> You know. Yell at some, yell at some little boys, yell at some old men. You yeah. know, you know how it goes. You know how we yeah, do it. That, I think, yeah, yeah. All right, let me get the. Whoops, that's not what I want. My excitement for, uh, for fucking Half Life Deathmatch. That is it's, not uh, true. Um, I don't think this is using Source. I don't know which one you're referring to. It's definitely not on Source 2004. Nothing uses 2004. It's not on the episode one branch. It might be on Orange Box, but I think it's. It isn't like... on Orange Box because I know there was a mod that experimented with porting it to Orange Box, so I know for a fact it's not Orange Box. 
Is it uh, MP twenty thirteen? <laughs> no, it's it's, not... it's way before then. Seriously, it's, uh, I it's before it's before. I'd say it's like on a similar branch to whatever the Counter Strike Source was. Counter Strike like Source, right I know, after. is on a later branch. I feel it's like... on a later branch than the original Half Life Two, but I I know this one's like on par with that. Because here's what I thought. I thought that you'd have, uh, you know, you'd have. I thought Valve was porting their their games to newer branches of the engine was the thing. Because uh, I know that Half Life Two obviously isn't on Source 2004 anymore, um, and I know that Episode One isn't on Episode One anymore. Um, so I figured this would be like MP twenty thirteen or something like that. Because I think TF Two is on that. But, TF2 is on it, I believe, but just they haven't fucking got around to touching this game. It's not worth the effort, I'm I'm sure. Uh, I don't know where in the console I'd be seeing that, Mew. I'm seeing... Uh, Yoshi asked who is the, uh, the person pointing the uh, gun to. That's me. That's what I look like. There's a real-life photo of me taken from the sex offender registry list. They they gave me permission to use it though. Wait, what are you looking for? Because Mew is saying that if you look in the console, uh, it'll tell you which engine branch it's in, but it's it's not. It's very much not here. Uh, I probably look. Uh, was released on. Well, not there. Either way, it kind of doesn't matter. I don't do... It's a shitty branch. I don't do B-hopping anyway. I'm not desync, so... Oh, yeah, and Mon might be joining in at some point. Uh, Even though he doesn't fucking own the game, apparently he's got some... He's got some family server, whatever. It's all right. You're not missing anything. How the fuck do you not not own this game at this point? I'm amazed like how many people don't yeah. actually own this game. I remember bothering everybody back in like 2013, 2014, buy Half Life 2 Deathmatch. I it's like it. five bucks, man. What's wrong with you? Actually, yeah, I'll, I'll leave. I'll even Google it. I don't care. Match. You don't Check have five dollars. I'm so sorry. I don't have. Is it actually just five bucks? It is just. It is five, five bucks. What the fuck? Are you dollary doing? dude. Wasn't it free for a little bit? It was free as a Alex promotion. I I remember. I don't. I don't remember. Because Half Life Death or Half Life Alex came out, and I remember they set every single Half Life game to free, didn't they? I'm not gonna fucking buy you uh, Half Life Two Deathmatch. Okay, I think that's the last time I should be interrupted. Anyway, five dollars, five dollars. You have five dollars. Yes. So that was the that was the promotion that I was remembering. If you had Lost Coast, they would give you Portal First Slice, Half Life Two Deathmatch, or if you had an ATI card, you'd get Lost Coast, Half Life Two Deathmatch, and Portal First Slice. Um, I forgot about Lost Coast. Lost Coast. I honestly prefer to to. I I, I don't. <laughs> I'm not buying you Deathmatch. Take it back. No. It, go pirate it or something, or no. go uh, buy it. <clears throat> I'm telling you, we are the most professional stream on the internet. So we're just gonna hop right into my personal favorite server of all time, Loki School of Combat. Now I've been Still playing, on, I've been playing on this server for years. By the way, this this map is apparently called uh, DM Spookface OB. So I, maybe it is on the maybe it is on Orange Box. I'm not sure. Um, I mean, you can you can join if you look in the server browser. You guys can all play with me. It's perfectly fine. Um, but anyway, oh, Griff muted. I was like, oh, did he drop? What? I, I was I was wondering. Am I if still you, muted? I was, I, yeah. Oh. I was wondering if you oh. dropped. Am I still you, muted? I was, I, yeah. No, oh. you're good now. I was wondering if you oh, dropped. Okay. Am I still you, muted? You dropped. I, I wasn't sure if you were it because I wasn't getting any audio from you uh, in the meter, so I wasn't oh, sure if oh, if you were it. if the call had dropped or if you were muted or whatever. By the way, 
If this stream gets kind of funky at some point because it's downloading stuff, I apologize in advance. It's just the nature of playing uh, online games. But we should be good when the, the, the game actually starts. Um, and if not, we will find something else to play or we will just screw around because I am more than fine with it. Although it's still saying excellent connection, so wait, we should be good. We should be good. All right. Should be. We are in. We are in. This is my. This is one of my favorite maps. I freaking. I love this map because it was actually ported over. Twenty four seven. Yeah. Well, it's not a. It's not twenty four seven for this map. Loki has a has a rotation. Um. But anyway, the thing I really like this about this. Map we oh. Last ooh. I, I. I did not notice. You're gonna be seeing some cool. Uh. Cool deaths, courtesy of me, by the way. Hope you guys know, because I am. Not very good at this. Shotgun. I I am rusty, but I was holding my own on whatever server I was playing on last night. I just wanted to test it to see if it still worked. I'm gonna oops, get off the ladder. Whoops. Okay, we're good. Um, yeah, this is one of my this is a this is a personal favorite map of mine from fucking ages ago it was a, it's a half-life map that's why all the textures look like it does uh because it's just a half-life map that uh, yeah created. yeah that makes sense well I, I want to know the fucking context behind this map though me too me too but also i kind of don't because it's glorious it's very nightmarish though oh it's it's a horrifying map there's just faces everywhere and it's like vaguely greek with all the marble and stuff i don't know uh there we go there's griff does mean I I have a menu? Oh! I, said I had a menu. Fuck! Fuck! Whoops! Rip! Oh, fucking shit! Man, oh, I, I, I again I suck. Game. So you know. Ow! Come on! Fuck! <laughs> I, I'm not gonna get a single. You know what? Honestly, even if I'm just constantly screwing up, at least it's fun. So we're fine. And we get to experience this, this glorious map. Listen, this map Fucking is this map is an experience. So maybe I can it really least, is. maybe I can at least get some kills with a shotgun. Maybe, please. There's like these fucking dudes who have memorized this map. Yeah, that's this is a clown. This is a, I was about to say a clown server. This is a clan server. Um, so. You know, these guys have been playing since, like, the game came out, basically. So you... If you yeah. suck... If you suck, it's very apparent. Fuck, I need to stop trying to take this guy on. Fucking shit. He is, like, the most this powerful is... in the entire server. I'm sure we've lost, like, 12 viewers at this point, yeah. Actually, let me oh, check. you fucker, get back here. Yeah, no. Uh, we got, uh... <laughs> uh we get you. Oh my god, this is awful! Oh, you motherfucker. I you got one up, kill. Dude? I got one kill. Is that Brannigan? You got one kill, Damn dude. Damn it. Very proud of you. Damn it. And I couldn't catch him. God damn this fucking guy. I'm telling you, they, they're they are tough cookies on this server. Uh, worst case scenario, I will... What? Oh my god. I just seriously just spaz out every single time. Did you kill somebody with a stun stick? Yeah, I shot him a bunch. I think he was idle. I just fucking came up behind him and I, I stun sticked him. Ow. No. Don't hit me. Don't hit me, please. I'm young and my breasts are nubile. Wow. Oh, Damn you can it. fucking... You can choose... What weapon and shit you start out with? I just realized there's like a spawn menu. Really? This fucking Zap Brandon can fuck you. <laughs> this is the dumbest fucking gameplay. We've lost like half of our viewers. Nah, we're keeping steady. Get over here, Brandon. Yes! Alright, I'm gonna get it back. I'm gonna watch me. I'm gonna get it back. I'm gonna get it back. Are you gonna get back your mojo? Yeah, I am. Watch me. Watch mojo? 
Watch my mojo. No. No, I can't be killed by my guest. No. Fucker. Fucking Zab ran again. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, whatever, Ooh. Yoshi. Whatever, Yoshi. Oh! Man, you know, if only I wasn't terrible at... That person has fucking Alex as his model. Huh. I didn't know you could set Alex as your model. I mean, can't you use any player model? Not that I... I mean, maybe you can. The thing is, and I only just found this out as the stream was starting, uh, the way to set your player model, you can't set it in uh, the settings anymore. It doesn't yeah, work. Yeah, you have to do it in the console because they I, fucking broke yeah. it. Yeah. They broke it. So I that was that the last time I played. Was like, oh my God. That was news to me. Man, I remember being really good with a crossbow too. But I am just terrible at it right now. Yeah, get fucked, buddy. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah. Get over here, Alex. Ninety five health left. What? Ah, oh, why do I blow? Jesus. Hey. Play nice. I wonder who the fuck made this map. I don't know, but they're kind of awesome. They probably are like in a fucking insane asylum. Oh no, 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 no. I feel like they probably give us the uh, the VMF if we did that. Man. Whatever the fuck Half Life 1 used. RMF. Was it an RMF? Uh huh. Shit. I keep using jack files. I, I mean, they, they're all basically the same, honestly. They all work alike, but yeah. Did I, I didn't even get that fucker. I, I hit him a little. Happens. All good. So apparently we got Yoshi about to hop in. Yoshi, when you hop in, don't be, don't be, uh, don't be surprised when I harass you. <laughs> and make you leave. <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble. Fuck. I hate being at the bottom. Being at the bottom is the worst. Oh, I got that motherfucker with one health. Yes, yes it is. This fucking guy, what are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, you change your, your username inexplicably all over the place to you thirsting over some Undertale character. I was talking about fucking Zab Brannigan. Uh, Yoshi, what the fuck are you on? And I mean, it's, it's not all right. It's it, oh, I'm sure it's just a it's just a humor thing. I'm sure. We... No, don't kill me. I know, I know that's comedy's the... subjective, but you're fucking degenerate. No, I'm just kidding. Let's that's just funny. bully our users. Let's just bully. I think that would be a great idea. I think we should get into some gang wars. I think we it's get becoming into less parties. ironic every day, and I need help. You do. And I don't get me wrong. It's a fair choice of waifu, at least. But like, no. Let's not even get into that. Where are we? Where is anybody? Some fucking guy with his actual face on the wall. It's really scared. The more I play this map, and the more I realize how like fucking weird this map is. The more, hey, is that Brannigan, dude? Can you waifu you. hour? Listen, my waifu is Cappy. Okay. That's. You wanna have? Do you wanna have like? A, you wanna make out or something, dude? It's a possibility. I want to see what he says. <laughs> yeah, he said I knew him. No, concentration, Damn dude. It. That's kind of racist. Damn it. This guy wants concentration camp. So is this guy. How is this guy this good? Honestly. I, I we, we probably should have picked another server. I, <laughs> I think we should. I think I want to play on Walmart again. Remember that fucking amazing Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Why? Where we all camp the rooftops. No. I love that map. The rocket sniping that map. map. That map was so much fun. I it, was, it was awful, couldn't... but it was so much fun. I mean, you're kind of like Sable. Um, I couldn't. I I you hate fuckers that Brandon. Listen I... to me, you fucking mongoloid. Listen to me. I'm gonna make out with you, and I'm gonna make you feel my tongue in your fucking mouth, buddy. <laughs> Oh, you're teasing me! Oh, I like it. I like how you're saying that to me, buddy. Oh no, I forgot. Voice chat's a thing. Yeah, <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun with it. Oh man, is is this fucking Tom Jones? Tom Jones? No. 
Absolutely not. Is it not Tom Jones? I can't hear it. I think it is Tom Jones. I, it has to be, otherwise I'm retarded. Or mentally deficient. Speaking My bad. Cabby. Or what are retards like to be called? Or mentally challenged? I four folks like to be called nowadays. Fuck. Hey Yoshi, what is your kind like to be called? What is your kind like to be called? Which is going to be all the time if you end up joining. <laughs> wow, Borb. Okay, I guess it's just Half Life Deathmatch Hour. Nice. No! Damn it. You're all a bunch of teases until you actually join. Ah. You fucking bastards. Damn, let the noob get a kill. Damn. <laughs> wow. Dude, I have nine kills and 24 deaths. Finally, I killed the guy at the top of the server. <laughs> this is the worst fucking KD ratio. I feel just like I'm I'm in a clan war here, and I, and I'm like nowhere close to being anywhere near them. I feel like we might have to switch in a little bit. I do think it's we. Just, uh, yeah, really we're gonna try a different server in a bit. We're dude, just gonna yeah, hop yeah, in a bunch of servers. Pandemic, with the pandemic going on, yeah, we're just gonna jump in and harass a bunch of people. But with the pandemic going on, these fucking middle midlife crisis men are getting back on. It's like that one uh, CSS server I played once. It's just a bunch of fucking like forty year old men. <laughs> they didn't like me. <laughs> they didn't like me. That's fair. I mean, forty-year-old like men it. always had a problem with me. So they didn't have a problem with me. They just had a problem. You know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm implying that they're pedophiles. Oh. That's the joke. Ah. Hit the subscribe button. What the fuck sound clips are playing right now? This server has the weirdest sound clips. I might actually set it so it doesn't download any of the sound clips because they're just kind of like. Wait, you don't want people to yell the n-word on your stream? Maybe I do, but not right now. Where'd you go, you fucking bastard? Come here. I'm gonna fucking knife you, or whatever this fucking- Oh, oh my god, okay, yeah. should we switch? Uh, I wanna- I wanna play the next one, because we've already got Borb on the server, and we've already got, um... We've got Yoshi on the server. That's true. Oh, one more! No! <laughs> No, you guys will get to see in real time how awful this map is. I don't know if we played 2012 though. It could have been like because it is all rocket sniping, mm. all of it. I see your screen. This, this is the same map. This oh my so god, good. this tugs at my heartstrings a little. I love this. Man, this is fucking ca camp at the top or something. The wave of nostalgia. <laughs> the nostalgia critic. Yeah, I remember it, so you don't have to. I, I, I unironically found him funny when I was like 10 years old. Walker? Yeah. I did too. I, I don't even think he's that bad. He's he's pretty like fucking uh, washed up nowadays. Bro. Yeah. He, well, he hated it. That's the thing. He hated Nostalgia Critic by like 2015. Oh, and here's he Jake. Jake, why do you keep deleting that. your Twitter? <laughs> I'm going to ask Jake the hard questions live. Die, yeah, Zach Brannigan. You your your Die. 10 terabytes of child porn, you sick fuck. What, for Jake? Yeah. No, you'd be surprised. You'd actually be surprised. What Jake, would I be He was preyed on a long time by uh, somebody on Neo Cities. And uh, that person has since trooned out. So, you know. What the fuck do you mean trooned out? <laughs> Are they convicted sex offender now or something? No, they, uh... He's pretending. He's pretending to be, to be trans, for the, uh, the social points, as it were. Hey, speaking of trans, for watching this fucking stream, fuck you, bastard. I, the, seriously, my memory of Jackathan will always be colored by him just randomly in the middle of surface tension. By the way, I cut myself. I used. It to was in the middle of surface tension. It's like, what the fuck are you doing, you fucking troglodyte? Seriously, like that was. It was just the most random thing, and then five minutes later, he was gone. Just like, uh, alright, and now every time I think of surface tension, that's the only thing I can think of. They wanted to f he wanted to fucking speedrun it, and we were just trying to play the game, because I hadn't beat Half-Life at that point. So oh, I was man. just trying to I was trying to play it, and he just kept fucking speedrunning it. The fucking bastard. That's why you never play Sven co-op with anybody who's better than you. 
Hey, everybody in the server, I need you to know that, uh, what is that, Al Alphys? Yeah, uh, they just DM me on, uh, on Steam, and they asked for my nudes. So they're de they're technically a sex offender, so don't talk to them. Don't associate with them. Why? Anyways. Why? <laughs> Shut up, you little fucker. Why? No, you- Oh, no, Borb's on the mic, too. Oh, boy. Come fart. No. Thank you. I'll be here all week. No, I'm to I'm responsible for this now. You have ruined our stream. No, you've made it twenty times better. <laughs> this is the improvement stream. This is the stream where we uh Oh thanks Borb. I thought that was a little monetized. boy. To be fair, Borb sounds a lot like a little boy, yes. Isn't he is he not a little boy? Uh Nicole? No. Damn it. Oh, was that a woman? Captain Starburst is Borb, yes. Is that a girl? Is that a gamer girl? Can I please kiss you a little, please, oh, man? Griff is gonna start asking for your number, watch out. Yeah, can I kiss you a little? Like, mwah, mwah. I have no lips. I'm a fucking sex offender, it's okay. I keep going on about this joke, but when I get, when I get, like, actually uh, registered... Oh, no. Oh, I can stream. I'm... listen. I'm I'm making sure you never get mentioned next to VDU if you if you actually hit up on it registry. <laughs> Make sure they don't know I was an admin. Make I'll, sure I'll, I I was not associated with this person. No, I'll I'll have to I'll have to let out. They're gonna let me go if I if I admit that uh, VDU was used for other reasons other than just money. You know what I mean? Money laundering. Is that what we were doing with it? Child sex. Yeah. Oh, man. When I go to prison, I'm gonna make sure they ask you about a uh, little boy Birdie. No, no, not Birdie. No. <laughs> what the fuck has he been up to? What, is I... it? what have all these fucking retards been up, or uh, nice fellows been up to? <laughs> so, my last recollection of Birdie, I think Jax was talking to him. If anybody, I think. Oh yeah, I did see that in the chat. Um, but I stopped talking to him because I found him supremely annoying. Wow, you, you just found that out, like, like after that much time? Okay, here's the thing. There was a certain period of time where I was, like, I was like all right with him. I, it was, you know, I, I thought he was going to become something less annoying in the future, hopefully, maybe. Oh, no, get out of here. Fucker, no. come here. Come no. here, fucker. No. Damn it. Oh, yeah, fuck you. Come on. I had full suit, too. I had 200 suit. No, you're a fucker. That's what you are. That's, uh, your mom gay. Oh, man, I thought, ooh, look at that. Your, your mom gay. You suck bows along with hoes. I love that video, but I don't think anybody remembers it. No. So it was a rap battle video. No. <laughs> Just like the old days. Damn it. What were we talking about? Oh, yeah, VDU and sex offenders or something. All right, so Wait, I... How was, uh, how was... Most of those sex offenders been. The, I mean, the woman, I'm gonna take away your rights. Anyways. No you. I'll cut your dick off. I don't have one. I don't have one. Jackathan has entered the chat. Zeb, Zeb, uh, Brannigan, listen to me. Can we have like, can we have a little kiss moment? Yo. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> this, this, this is quite the uh, this is quite the treat for everybody in the chat right now. Ow. Only one retard on the mic at, at once, okay? I'm the main retard. Yeah, it's okay. all yours. He's he's smart. I'm on the mic. Hey, is that brand again? Why did you just message me on Steam asking for uh? Asking if I knew where uh, where child sex slaves could be bought, dude. Oh, I don't no. know that information. <laughs> Why are you are you a convicted sex offender or something? Mm. <laughs> I don't fuck it. I'm gonna get off this topic. Okay, we're, we're switching off this topic. Uh, what were we talking about? VDU in the in the fucking creepy bastards. Mon, you are missing. What was that? Other insanity. <laughs> Oh, no. damn it! Yeah, get fucked, you bastard. At least I changed my fucking model. Did he, did he fucking threaten to like? 
Oh, I almost walked into someone's I mind. Don't, I don't like this. They're, they're ganging up on me now. <laughs> That's what happens when you run yeah, your fucking I'm mouth. <laughs> Please don't bully me. Please don't. Just... I'm a little retard boy. I have autism. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking... I'm messing up the stream already. <laughs> they're both picking me. <laughs> Hey, don't do that. Don't do that. If you kick me, you're you're automatically a racist as well, because I'm also black. No, you're not. I am. No, you're not. Oh man. I couldn't hear you. I was I was too busy winning. What was that? <laughs> yeah, look at that. Yeah, then you're a group of racists. You're the Ku Klux Klan. You're literally you're li you're literally Whoops. erasing erasing. The nation's diversity, huh? This was like literally fucking swag. Literally fucking epic, bro. <laughs> Why is it fucking. I'm literally gonna fucking kiss you, you fucking bitch fucker. Yeah, please, please kick me, guys. I've already fucking gotten fucking kicked from the server. Is, is the vote kick like a kick? Is it like a suspension? Like I a... don't actually think there's vote kicking on this server. So they're just trying to scare me or something? Uh, you know if what? If there is vote kicking, I could probably just rejoin, couldn't I? I mean, that's what a kick is, yes. Yeah, I'd, I'd be really surprised if like it was like one of those suspension bans or something. Nah. By the way, guess, I like this little laptop over kicking. here that's uh that's uh, got OS... What is that? Panther on it? Maybe Jaguar? That's pretty sweet. Oh, I see on your screen. It looks like a fucking Black Mesa computer. Alright, anyway, what what was going on? My god. Something about VDU. I that's don't not remember. Tiger. That's not Tiger's, uh... That's not Tiger. I don't remember. Some angry old men got mad at me or something. I mean, it's not hard to see why. <laughs> I called him a sex offender. What's so, what's so bad with that? Are we supposed to be accepting of diversity? Die, Nicole, die. Dude, map map rebuilt by L. Steve. I want to find Steve and I want to give him a big ol' smooch. For making the greatest map I've ever played. I hate this map. <laughs> this, is, this is a great map. I hate this map so much. <laughs> Why? It's so good. It's so... It's a pain in the ass to get around. That's why I love it. Man. It's a perfect map. What the fuck were we talking about? I don't know. You just randomly decided to start fucking with people. <laughs> I told you I would. You, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. By the way, this is, this is really, this is exactly what VDU was like, by the way. In case you're wondering. Except we, we did it more. We did it a whole lot more. And, and whenever the grown men ganged up on me, uh, I had backup. You had backup. This time, I'm not touching you. <laughs> For the five foot pull. No. Okay. Okay. Absolutely I not. It. You're on your own. Speaking of old men, what happened to Cryokeen, dude? I know you're a big fan of his. Oh. Come on. Yeah, you bastard. Oh man. That's what you get. I'm literally the greatest fucking. I I, I thought it was funny, honestly, thinking about Keen because he was like some. He was like. Oh, I swear he was like a drug addict or something. He he fucking probably was. He he was really a dick. He was a fucking pothead for sure, but I don't remember what else he fucking did. And I remember he made videos about him just like fucking smoking pot or something. Yeah, he was uh he was a special boy. He was a special special boy. He was he was definitely something. That's that's for sure. And in any case, um he didn't like us much. He liked us for like 2 days. And then Before he was like fuck him, video. Like, Dude, Ray William Johnson. That's what I saw in the chat. That's all I saw in the chat. Yeah. But yeah, uh, and now he just makes fucking like Rick and Morty videos or something. Well, I'm not surprised. <laughs> and he talks about like his high intellect and how he's based or something. And like, to be I fair, think, like, Keen is a high IQ up. individual. To be fair, he's fucking he's fucking on the other plane. He is on just, the spectrum. Just the thing. He's on the spectrum of fucking wokeness. He, he he posts videos of like of like Pepe and he and it's called like based red pill or something cryokeen and like and then he'll do some shit like uh, 
he'll talk about how much he loves Donald Trump, and then a week later he'll switch and he'll be like, why I think that, uh, why Bernie Sanders or something, and then he'll go on into like, why Joe Biden's the best. Then he'll just make, he, he doesn't know how to keep his fucking mind in, uh, in order. So he keeps fucking <laughs> switching his uh, opinions up. And it's really fucking weird, because I just, I wake up every morning and I check my phone. I see this fucking, this fucking man-child keeps uploading shitty videos. My tree. I keep, that's really off-putting. I'm so sure that's a little boy. It's not, I can promise. <laughs> Women. That don't exist. <laughs> Based in cryo -keens. Um, but yeah, anyway, um, I, for what, I, I'm not even really sure why people were so set on defending Keen. He really wasn't in our community so much as he was in the Sven co-op community, and they had a lot of overlap with us. Sorry to, sorry to have a, a, uh, unpopular opinion, folks, but what the fuck is the appeal of Sven co-op? It's just fucking Half-Life, except you can play with friends and it's got an updated engine. At what point do you just go fucking, uh, I don't know. Play like Half Life, make maps for Half Life Two or something. <laughs> that, that's that's my that's my opinion on Sven. My opinion is that Half Life Two was a mistake. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow, nice shot. I heard a nice shot. Thanks for uh, thanks oh. for playing. Thanks for playing, Yoshi. Thank you for enjoying the the spam of my host or my co-host. Yeah, that was a. Hey, Zab Brannigan sounds like he's gonna fucking sex offend people, if you know what I'm saying. No. No, he doesn't. It's so <laughs> he bad. Does, he does. It's I so bad. Registered. It's so bad, Yoshi. It's so bad. This map. No, this map is fantastic. No, this map is so bad. All I feel right. like this is like an official Valve map, and like they just forgot to ship it. This was definitely in the beta, I'm pretty sure. I would rather get coronavirus. No, you wouldn't. You'd rather play on, you'd rather play on fucking uh, Walmart. No, I genuinely. This is actually not that terrible of a map, if I'm gonna be completely honest. Like, it's not a great map, but like, it's okay. Fun. What? All right. By what metric would it be a good map? What metric? Yeah. Like, am I rating like deathmatch maps? Yes. Like, show you. Okay. So the one that we played last round was this like spook face or whatever. That one was like a. I would say it's like a decent. Uh, shit. I I don't know. Maybe a seven and a half. Because I feel it has a good aesthetic, and it's it's very it's very good because it's a remnant of its time, but it fucking plays like shit. That's my only downside. I hate how it plays. Uh, this map looks like shit. It it plays kind of like shit as well, but it's it's pretty funny as a as a, like a joke map. Okay, so it's a shit but post. Anyway, you like it because it's, it's kind a of a, it's kind of a shit post, but I also I feel it plays pretty well to be honest. How how does it play pretty well? <laughs> I don't know. I get lost in it at some point. Exactly. Like, point, That's why it's bad. Oh, come on. I guess. This is good, like, background background music. It got so... It was such good background music that I fucking called somebody a sex offender or something. Yeah. Um, this, uh, honestly, this is the griff of maps. <laughs> this is the, uh... I'm the, I'm the connoisseur of shitty maps. This oh, if you, if you, there's a, there's something you could pick up. There was like a, a bottle of whiskey or something. And if you hit E on it, it's like stevesmaps.co or something. Yeah, yeah the exploding play. bottles of whiskey. Yeah, well, they really, he really wanted to promote his fucking shitty map. <laughs> I feel like, okay, if this map was like 2006 or so, I feel like this map would be, would be pretty good for the time. But this is 2012. And I mean, you have to think what you're going against. Uh, I you know, mean, TF2 already came out. Counter as Strike, dude, far Counter -Strike as like Half Life Deathmatch stuff goes, I this know. is pretty shit. I mean, if this was 2006, yeah, I'd say this is a fucking masterpiece. Of 2006. No, it's not good by 2006 <laughs> standards. What's wrong with you? What the fuck do you mean? I mean, it's <laughs> terrible. It's bad. <laughs> this map isn't that bad. It's a little too open, if I'm going to be completely honest. See? It's annoying to navigate. Frankly, how much time <laughs> Okay, you know what? I, under I understand your what you're meaning now, but, like, it's still a pretty enjoyable map sometimes. It's... Like, the rocket... Actually, no, these rocket camping bastards or something. They're getting on my nerves, but still. Exactly my <laughs> point. 
I've already. I've, okay, I, I'll knock it down. Uh, okay, Spookface was a seven point five. I'll give this one like a like a like a five, maybe a five and a half. Okay. I feel like that's maybe a little too generous, though. Yeah, I I would say this one's a solid maybe two and a half. I'm gonna go. Th I go. It doesn't leak. I will give it four. that. It it does not leak. If it leaked, then I would have to give it a ten. But no, it doesn't. Leak. If it oh. leaked, uh, it would make it like four <laughs> times better. If it leaked and it like fucking hurt my eyes to look at, I'd have to raise it up a bit. But no, it didn't even get that right. Oh, I got you, motherfucker. Jesus. Uh, but yeah, I'd give this map like a four. I think that's a pretty good, uh, a pretty good rating for it. I think it's, I think it's a pretty decent map. I think it's very simple, and that's what holds it down. It would be better possible. if it was a full packed Walmart full of, uh, full like of like boxes and, and aisles and groceries. Yeah, I I agree. Why is it playing? Why is it playing Elvis Presley? Do I feel like fucking scared or something? Damn it! Is this new? Am I am I going schizophrenic? I mean, I hear it too, but that's <laughs> what the, this that's what this server does. They play sounds. So it makes you think you're going insane or something. Pfft, what? How did I hit him? That was like some OG, like some no scope shit. Jesus. Should we phase after that one, dude? Yeah. What I the was... fuck is phase one up to? Oh man. They're just kind of like touching girls or something and having sex. Mon, Mon is on. We got him on. Whoops. Let me not run into someone's side. You know, I, I really should be... I should change my name. I should change my name in honor of where I came from. What is that? I'm gonna name Your my, mom? I'm going to name myself Pac. If I can figure out where. You sound like Half-Life 1, you old man. You have to... It goes on your Steam name. You, you can't change your name point. anymore? Do, do chain... Oh, wait, no. It doesn't even do change name. No, I... I guess it must be on a different branch then. But yeah, yeah, you it goes on Steam names now. Okay. Half Life One is the only remnant of that that actually still does it. I think. That's pretty gay. Damn it. Yeah. Man, can this fucking map be over already? Jesus. I fucking died off some potted plants. Are you shitting me? <laughs> I died off your shitty prop. Oh god. Oh, I, I yeah, love I'm gonna, that. I'm gonna have to that down. Yeah, I'm gonna have to bring it down a little. Oh, is that Brannigan, you fucking pedophile? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what? He saw 91 health? What the fuck is this shit, dude? Seriously, he is, uh. He's pretty talented. Everybody, can we please, uh, can we please start a, a movement on Twitter where we called this random guy I met in Half-Life Deathmatch a dirty, stinking pedophile? No. No, we cannot do that. <laughs> let's not go on, like, a fucking, uh, Twitter do you do your thing no, let's type not, moment. let's not do that. <laughs> this random fucking, this poor dude, he hasn't even, like, done anything. You just, you just picked a fight with me. I picked a fight with him. You and picked then... a fight with him and you started bullying him and then he was like, well, let's <laughs> vote kick you. Responded. But he didn't even vote kick me. It didn't even work. Because I don't think, I think he was just bluffing. Yeah, the server doesn't have vote style. kick, I don't think. Well, it scared me enough, I guess. I mean, yeah. Oh, you I stopped. Fuck. I did stop. But <laughs> that was because I felt bad. Or something. Man. Hey chat, can you uh can you give us some hypotheticals that we could uh, can you give us some moralistic questions that we can answer? Yeah, how like, how are you doing tonight, chat? How's it going? Because we've yeah, been chat. Uh, chat. I mean Griff has been particularly annoying. Um No I fucking haven't. Yes. Fucking you. I've been wonderful <laughs> I've been wonderful. You've been an angel. You've been a saint. Yeah. No, let me come back to the show every once in a while. I don't know what's gotten into me. It's just really funny to call people fucking that. I'm not even going to say the word anymore. You know what I'm saying? This is, this is, a, this is an awful accusation I put on to people. Got him. This fucking guy's probably like 40 years old, and he's just like, he, he has like a wife or something. Is Griff a, a slur? Cool yeah, where does the name Griff come from? It was from my name. 
What is your name? My name is Griffin. <laughs> it's like not even. It's not even like a. Uh, it's not even like a secret anymore. That's just my name. And then the bow came from something. I don't remember. Probably like. I don't know. I've been trying to figure it out, but I can't even remember where it came from. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna make it kind of funny, and I'm just gonna say it came from Dane Bow, the guy who made fucking annoying Orn. We'll just say that. But I don't think. I don't think that's what. It, I don't think that's what it's from. I mean, that's what they. My parents actually named me after uh, Harry Potter, and I fucking despise Harry Potter because of it. We uh. It we, like, every so often, Cabby and I will make fun of, of Harry Potter because it's. It is. It's pretty overrated. It I mean, I saw the movies. That was about it. Yeah. I mean, they were. They were something. They were all right for the first two. See, I'm, I'm more of a, I'm more of a Star Wars man. But even then, uh, that hasn't been too great. Tee. Recently, it's sad seeing your favorite thing get like fucking killed. But then again, I, I think I understand how the fucking, uh, dude, these fucking retards, fucking Peter Griffin. Some motherfucker came into my work, and I was like. I was taking his fucking order. I don't work at fucking McDonald's, don't say that. I work in a, I work in fucking, I worked at a movie theater. I probably won't anymore because like, probably gonna fucking close because the movie business is over. But some We're not allowed to dude, go outside anymore. Yeah. Some fucking dude who's high as shit. I think they were going to see Medea's, Medea's Halloween or something. The newest fucking Medea. And then, what the fuck is that Brannigan on? Uh, some fucking guy, he came in and he, uh, he was really high with his friends, and he he read my name tag. He said, "Oh, Griffin, like Peter Griffin," and then he laughed for like fucking a minute straight. That's what and that's I, what people who are high do. Absolutely. Yeah, I just sat there with a straight face. It's like you can't really tell him shut the fuck up. He just kind of go, uh huh, uh huh. I went like, uh huh, uh huh. Yep, yep. That's... But fuck you. That's that's where I'm getting to the end of the story. Fuck you. Don't ever call me that. I'm not funny, man. I'm not funny, man. Family guy. I wish I was though. I wish I was funny man Seth MacFarlane almost dying in 9/11 or something. That's that's the most legendary story ever. This man was supposed <laughs> to get on the plane that hit the twin towers, but he was secretly in charge of 9/11. Uh, so then he didn't get on the plane, but oh. then he but then he made up some fake excuse, he was, and then he tried to expose Harvey Weinstein or something. I don't he remember. Was drunk. Come on. Uh, family Guy funny moment. Chris or. Er, uh, Peter gets addicted to meth or something. I don't remember what that video was. <laughs> it was like Peter gets addicted to crap. That's my favorite one that I see. But yeah, that was named after fucking Harry Potter, and that's that's where the the fucking uh, name uh, Griffo comes from or something. I don't remember. Impressive. Yeah. What a, what a I good love name. it. I love it. You've got all the people who normally play, and then you've just got us at the bottom. <laughs> Okay, we're uh, at least we're we're ahead of uh we're ahead of your two friends. Well, Meaning listen, we're I'm better be, than them. I I parts. want I'm gonna be the nicest I can be. At least Borb doesn't play these games, and Mon we're fucking zero and thirty five. What the fuck are you doing, little girl? that sounds like a boy. What are you doing, you bastard? But yeah, <laughs> I, I I don't blame him. At this point, it's just kind of a fuckery of dumbass Walmart. Walmart gameplay, and this is like, this is awful. I'm telling you, this map I, I sucks. I, it lost its fucking uh, appeal of uh, like 20 minutes ago. Uh huh. Steve Maps. Co. Uk. Fuck you, Steve. Um. So yeah, I, we're probably gonna be hopping into another server. I want to play. I want to play a default map. I want to play maybe. I'm not sure which one I want to play next, actually. I feel like all the only the only maps are going to be fucking uh, custom maps, which I'm. No, I've fine seen a couple that. servers see. that have. Gonna... Damn. Damn it! Are they actually just running default ones? Is uh, somebody making fun of Borb's listen? I I, I didn't hear, but that'd be freaking funny. Uh, the next DM... one. The next map, Porno Johnson's house shark. All right, we kind of have to see that map. I I really want to see that one, so I'm I'm perfectly fine with with suffering through Mc or I was called a McDonald's fucking. Uh... We're not gonna be playing the entire the entire round. <laughs> I, I just really want to see what Porno Johnson. Yes. Uh, DM Porno Johnson's house shark. I want to see what it is. That map sounds legendary. I I think it's like it's like a remnant of fuck 2010 and some like fucking child made it.
Honestly, be I mean, because I that map was not in Loki's rotation before. In fact, I'm kind of sad about some of the maps that uh, Loki did end up getting rid of. There was one that was really, really cool that, frankly... Hey, but dude, don't, for, don't forget, they, they got rid of them to make space for better maps, such as Walmart. Oh, Walmart's always been in the rotation. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but still, they, they got rid of, like, that map, other maps, instead of fucking Walmart. I'm gonna fucking melee you. Fucking shit, boy. No. 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 You pissy bitch, motherfucker. <laughs> Borb's a gamer girl. Dude. Shoddy's like a melody. What a great classic. I mean, it's a, something it, you would've heard of fucking Just Dance. Is it yeah, a bop? Dude. Yeah, do you not know that song? No. What are you, some fucking old man, dude? You go, I'm Shoddy. white. Griff, like I'm white. So, I'm kind of white. Are you half black? No, I'm 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 half Asian. What? You didn't know that? No, I didn't. What the fuck? I thought you knew that. Oh my gosh! Wow, we're just getting all my. It's a very back. white song. Yeah, but like, I, even I know it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm half Asian. I'm not like a, a nasty it's a very fucking white song. Felix. Felix Asian. I'm a I'm a Korean man. Speaking of which, what happened to that motherfucker? No memes. I don't know memes. No, I do not. Who the fuck calls them memes nowadays? What are they called? The bunnies. They make me laugh. Right. Oh my fucking god, I'm being fucking double teamed. <laughs> He's getting it in both holes, boys. Dude, dude, why are you bullying me, dude? This, this is upsetting. These fucking guys. You're having a good time because you've got shitty internet. Having a good time. I don't know. Oh my god, my internet is shit. What is happening? Your ping. Dude, what the fuck? Dude, you're you're a lifesaver actually. I didn't know that. Where the fuck is the server hosted? Argentina or something? <laughs> yeah, good game, guys. Yeah, I think it's hosted in the good old state of uh, Texas. All right, let's see what DM Porno Johnson house jerk. <laughs> I'm really excited for this. <laughs> Oh, bro. What? Oh, it's awful. This is the best map <laughs> ever. This is unironically a map that I would have made when I was like 14. Dude, I'm not even gonna mess with you. I think this is much better than a fucking. I think my mic was still going. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, this is this is unironically. I really want to fucking play this map. I I want to play this for a little bit. This is fucking awesome. Let's this do is it. So bad. Let's do it. This is I, this isn't even bad. You know, this is like peak. I want to I want to imagine somebody like. Who really know? Who like really knows mapping? Made this map just as like they went through a fucking break. Your dad is drunk, Yoshi. You should uh, you should fucking. I'm not kidding when I say this like map -tank plan, is like. This is probably the best map of the night. Why is my ping so bad though? Holy shit! This... Oh my good lord! <laughs> okay, that shouldn't have Dude, happened. Fucking ping! Oops. My fucking ping is at two hundred. Rip. Uh, at no. this point, I'm, I'm more or less here just to just to have some fun. So oh, I'm not no. even gonna fucking worry about it. This map is this map is amazing though. You remember temp? What was it? Temp seventy three? Yes. The Dude, I want to like do, I want to give that the uh, this the temp seventy three. I said we just fucking remaster it. I said we take this, add some nice lighting to it, uh, fix up the textures, because you know there's some little boy in 2010 or something made this map. That boy I, might I have wanna... been me, not gonna lie. Is this your map? It sh it... I'd like to listen. I have a map. I unironically have a map that I still I kept the source of because it's just so fantastic that is exactly like this. Most I... of my maps, yeah, most of my maps are either like this or they were flat uh, planes with. Like... They were mainly TF2 maps, and they were just like a flat plane with the king of the hill. Like, oh my god, you can pick up the fucking horse statue. This is awful. <laughs> um, it's just like a flat plane with a, a middle section with a cap. And that was you there. need to and, see like, DM Temp School. I might compile it. I might actually compile that map. Do you make one of your fucking school? <laughs> okay, listen, that's a story that's so legendary. I have to just, I, I just have to take a moment and talk about it, all right? Go ahead. I don't, I don't know this. Okay, so I was about, what, I was like, 13 14 years old i'm not even going to respawn i don't care i i'm focused on telling the story so i was in eighth grade 
and I had just recently gotten into level editing. And the one thing that just immediately snapped to me, like, I need to make this a map, is a map of my junior high school. Unironically. <laughs> so, I did it. I didn't know how to map. I didn't know anything about map. This might have been the very first map I ever made, honestly. Like, like seriously tried to make. And it was terrible. It was genuinely terrible. And then I, I went through a couple of other iterations of this map, but somewhere down the line... Uh, my the people who were running my school thought I was dangerous and started digging into my online life, like literally digging up old accounts and stuff and sharing them like in like private correspondence and whatever. And they were trying to put together basically a dossier about how dangerous I was, so that I they didn't have to deal with me anymore. It's and fucking of, incredible. And one of the things that they used as proof was this this video I had on one of my old YouTube accounts of this school, um, and they were like. Actually, I think what might have tipped them off, it was it, this was just a small a small part of it. But the one of the things that probably tipped them off was I was look I, I I went to the office, and I asked for a floor plan of the school, and they thought I was like, oh my fucking god, dude. I was. Why would you do that? I was thirteen and I was horribly autistic. Okay, I still am. I guess it's true. Yeah. I I still I'm, am, but I was especially insult, time. Yeah. I guess, yeah. How am I winning on this map? But yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, I guess it's true. What year was this? 2013? It's 2013. I was gonna say if it was like, I forgot how old you were. I was like, what is this, like early 2000s? Maybe they wouldn't have known how to deal with it better. But I guess, yeah, it is a little weird for a, for like a, uh, what, what, what year were you in? Uh, I was in eighth grade. Maybe ninth grade. Eighth grade, definitely. I guess, yeah, it would be a little odd that a that like a little fucking kid starts asking for floor plans because like i don't feel like anybody anybody would use the floor plans except for like adults so i guess that makes sense yeah so one of the videos suspicious. that they they were passing around as proof that i was like suspicious or something was a video and what it didn't even really look like the school it was literally just like a donut and i think i had a later build of the map that was like like it had like a, it had the quote unquote uh like main like the entrance, and then it was just like this yeah. one donut with a courtyard, and you couldn't even fit any uh, like classrooms and stuff in there. It was so bad, and I, I that was the junior high school, and then because I was dedicated, dedicated to making this a thing. By the time I got back into school in tenth or eleventh grade, this was actually Borb. This was right around. The, I've, I've mentioned this in the Ash chat, have I not? Um, because. This seriously has been a long time project of mine. I'm not even focusing on it anymore, but you get my point. Um, I had uh, another build of it that was based on our actual high school, which has a far more interesting layout. And that was all right, except for the fact that I had made it slightly too small. Like, uh, because at this point, I was already a pretty decent mapper, so I knew what I was doing. Uh, but by that point, I, I, I was just kind of, I was also kind of over it. And I just, I just knew that I didn't have, like, the modeling chops to be able to make desks and stuff. And that I'd actually gotten to the point where I was literally taking pictures of, like, uh, textures and whiteboards and stuff. Uh, you know, pictures of uh, whiteboards and uh, tiles and stuff trying to get this thing as accurate as possible. So, I mean, I I'm not going to blame them for thinking it was a little bit off. But either way, I was, like, I was, I'm a little white kid. Um... I'm not even remotely dangerous. I haven't been, I have no history of violence, but they, they thought I was going to be like, they thought I was going to, you know, Eric Harris, the place, you know? So we just, uh, it's a true I mean, story. at the end of the day, it's just a bunch of fucking old people <laughs> just seeing you taking pictures of fucking desks. Yeah. And fucking ask me for floor plans. Yeah. I guess I would be a little suspicious. It's a little suspicious. So yeah, I, I was fucking love this. I was uh, I was a special boy. I was a special boy. Now, do you kids want to see it? Do you kids want to see this map? Because do you have the fucking map like compiled? Uh, I don't have it compiled, but I can compile it real quick. Let me check actually my. <laughs> do we want to fucking play it? Do we want to shoot it? Map. I have. I still actually have the before. first map I ever made. It was called Hallway, and it's so it doesn't it doesn't even it's 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 a leak. It's a leaky map too. Okay, That's so everybody terrible. wants to see me play this map. So I'm gonna disconnect from the server real quick, and I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep the game open, but I'm going to in OBS. Let me just make 
Are you gonna compile it for Half Life Two Deathmatch? It was made for Half Life Two Deathmatch. Oh my fucking god! Yeah, just like shit. Could you just host a game or something? I'm gonna just compile yeah, it and show awesome. it on stream, honestly. Okay, yeah, do that. All right. <laughs> Let me make sure that I don't have anything. I I should probably not show off open, like Discord. Um. Okay, I think we're good. I think we are good other than that fuck this fucking porno johnson map this porno okay, johnson okay, map is, is so quality though not gonna lie fucking leave. fuck that fucking map all right so it, it, it gonna... is genuinely quality all right so transition we're gonna switch okay so oops we're not gonna give that one away real quick i should mention by the way that if you guys stick until stick around until the end i have story time for you and Believe me, you're going to want to stick around for this because this is something that I've wanted to read on stream for months now. Okay, so I've got my I've got my little uh, my little pack of uh, quote unquote finished maps because I just wanted them down. I just wanted them gone basically. Um, and yeah, I guess I could do it all right in here. Yeah. All right. Anyway, so we are going to. So, I, first things first, I do want to show off the, the first map I've ever made. So, I've, I've got that out. And then I've got three three versions of what I called DM School. Actually, four versions. So, I've got, I've got Test, which is dated August 2014. That might be the, that might be the earliest one. Uh, Proto School is dated May 2013. Old uh, is dated March 2015. And then the most recent version is dated uh october 2016 so yes it's gonna be it's gonna be absolutely quality so we're just going to uh we're gonna get we're gonna get hammer going what oh i forgot they have it in common now that's it's called common all right so deathmatch been i haven't i haven't opened hammer in years in fact i think the last couple of level editors i opened up were jack uh so i got so used to jack and then when i used uh hammer again it fucking sucked hammer is pretty clunky yeah but anyway like, i didn't understand the complaints until i finally went back to it and it's like oh my god it keeps fucking crashing it, it's pretty bad yeah all right so i'm gonna show you the first map i ever made i kept it i didn't keep a lot of my old little maps that i played with but i will show you what that what that looked like um and it was called hallway i have not edited this at all it, it i'm surprised it's even sealed i really am so you have <laughs> it, it, this is i have a what like a picket fence texture on the ceiling at least these are tiles at least these are tiles and that's a brick this is a citizen uh i swear at one point i actually tried to make him ragdoll uh but i didn't know how to use prop ragdoll so i think i just used npc citizen and set the animation to ragdoll so that was pretty great uh so that's that's the first map i ever made and i figure you know what let's compile it let's compile it and just, just oh, make I'll, it an official deathmatch, man. Yeah, I could show you it. So, map hallway. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> this was the problem with it. Back. She just constantly t poses. Gone. That's literally it. This is everything. This is the entire map. I think maybe I had. Yeah, I have literally a couple of uh, a couple of ammo things in the corner. That's about it. I think that's almost as good as Porno Johnson's map. Nah, I think Porno Johnson's map takes takes the cake. All right, so let's show off another one. So let's get into the school ones. So the earliest one that I have is Proto School. This one is so quality that I'm not even going to show you it in the editor. I'm just going to compile it and we're going to run around it together. Oh no. Oh, I apparently had lighting in there. We're just gonna fucking run around. 
I apparently had lighting in this. That's so bad. Will you bless the world and really... Do you want the maps? Do you really want them? There's Sources no... where you can just join, can't you? No, I think he's talking about... Anyway. Okay, so DM... That oh, was actually called Proto School. You know what? Sure. I might. I might just do that. So, here we go. Borb, were you around in the junior high school? Because if you do, you'll remember this. So this was this was supposed to be the foyer area of the of of the junior high, and you're actually going to see this uh, rendered a little bit better as we because I I did this in multiple attempts. Uh, so this is just a door. This is just a door and glass without any kind of bezel whatsoever. But you can break the glass, so it's okay. This is supposed to be the uh, the administrator's office. Uh, this is my this was my attempt at trim. Oh, fucking god. This is just... It's just so good, is it not? It's so good. It is. And don't worry, you'll see this in a little bit more refined as we get on. Actually, no, this was the guidance office. And this was supposed to be administration. But, unfortunately, I had no concept of how scales work. So, I just kind of built it. I just kind of said, fuck it, YOLO, and just built it. Seriously, look how thick these fucking brushes are. These... These brushes are, like, beyond thick. I think that has to be, what, like, what, 64 units thick for a floor? I had no clue what I was doing. Oh, fuck, yeah, for a floor, yes, that's that's either 32 or 64. That's I think it's 64, though. That's that's so unnecessary. So this was a hallway. As you can see, this is the best layout. This is absolutely the best layout. These are supposed to be classrooms, but I just, I just never got around to doing anything with the is classrooms. Is there a fucking bit poking out from it? Is it, what? is it in the top right corner? I think it's lowered. Or what is it? There's like light in it. Is there? Yeah. Um, I think that's just part of the texture. Is it? Yeah, no, Borb, trust me. I'm showing this because it looks absolutely nothing like it. Uh, I, oh, look, look, do you see that? It's, hold on, turn sheets on. Let's get really close. Do you see that? It just <laughs> it's not fucking lined up it's not lined up that's so good man i was on some shit when i was 13 oh my fucking god so this was another classroom this was all classrooms <laughs> i don't even remember what this was supposed to be dude the textures aren't lined up it's so good the textures are just who cares right How oh man i tried i so oh, tried here it is is this is this the uh, the crossover? Look back. Is this where the other map was? Yeah. So. The, no, the entrance to the lunchroom is way down. Oh, this is the one classroom that I actually did do. Check it. I was I was seriously just on that default prop shit. A nice blackboard oh too. God. Nice blackboard. Nice computer. Chair. I like that the wooden desk, because this is Breen's desk, and you were never meant to have guns, so they set the prop type wrong, so it's got metal sounds and uh, bullet holes, even though it's wood. And then, this was, uh, th there's a courtyard area out here. Uh... Oh, I remember what that, that's supposed to be the library back there. So, this is oh just a big God. courtyard area. so good it's so good i remember having i remember being like so amazed at all of this glass like oh wow you can shatter it and it like shatters into tons of pieces yeah the junior it's high had like a it was like a weird courtyard in kind of the center of the of the loop so this was my biggest attempt at the library And then the, the, the library had this, like, little... Seriously, no bezels. Nothing holding this side of the glass up whatsoever. So good. So good. This is a classic uh, first map. This seriously is. It just... I, I had no concept of bezels. How thin is that? What, which what? That glass. How thin is that glass? Uh, you know what? I'll actually check in the editor real quick. Ah, uh, it is... Where are we? We are... The glass is 
16 units thick. Is it? 16 entire units thick. So, also, I had Is no... Is it just rendering on one side? Yeah. I guess that would make sense. I didn't realize that. Did yeah. I use the uh, break surf. Yeah, I used uh, surf for here. I also like that I had no concept of, like, an outside. Yes. Yes. They just literally let kids out and play in the parking lot. I'm not kidding. Um, But, like, you can just walk on the sky and, like, see underneath the entire building. Just no concept of anything. And this is the, this is the top of it, too. Just absolute quality. <laughs> oh, good. Magical. Magical. So I've shown you, this was proto school. So this is literally from 13 year old Cami. Uh, I think. Actually, I'll be right back. Continue telling your story. All right. So, yeah, so this map was uh, not particularly great, but I didn't know what I was doing at the time. So, also, there's just this random beam just floating. I don't even remember what this was supposed to be. In fact, uh, maybe, um, I swear this is supposed to be, this is like another entrance into the building, I think. Either way, just so, just so, just so good. So good. All right, let's get, uh, let's get the next version of school open. So DM school test, it was called. Oh, none of the textures exist anymore. Oh, that's sad. This was the version of the map that actually got me in trouble. Uh, but I'm just going to quickly fix all the textures because otherwise they are going to appear as nothing. So this is about a year later. This is about me slightly knowing what I was doing a little bit more, slightly. Um, but anyway... So I'm just going to let this compile real quick. <laughs> Static prop, metal ladder, O2 outside the map. Got him. Nothing but the finest. Nothing but the finest. So yeah, this is also, again, based on the junior high's layout. So again, you'll be getting a concept of what's going on here. Um, uh, you can see how it's been refined a little better. Not great, but refined a little bit better. Um... Compiling can take a little bit, so stay with me, chat. I promise you it's doing something. Oh, nope, nope, it's not done. I thought it was done. Sorry, my bad. How many people are watching currently? We still got eight people watching. Excellent. Let's check some analytics while we're here. Stream health is good. Very good. Chat rate. Yeah. Chat's all right. Especially now that I've been talking about this map. Um, oh, we're done. All right. So. So let's get into the test map. So this is a little bit later on. Oops, I'm stuck in the ground. I apparently placed a crowbar at some point. So all of my custom texture work is missing at this point, but you get to see a little bit how this got refined a little bit better. Still no, uh, this is supposed to be the gymnasium area, hence all the roller mines. Uh, where's my, do I not have a gravity gun? I guess I don't have a gravity gun. Bro, what is, is this a gym? This is supposed to be the gym, hence the roller mines. Wow. Uh, Griff, I don't have any of my custom textures, so they're going to be... Uh, so I've just replaced them all with that one brick texture, basically. What, just, what what, just what Hammer did, but don't worry. You're gonna you're seeing quality here, I promise. What, what were the brick textures supposed to be? Oh, oh, like the actual textures you, you took? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Is that a micro gap? Uh trying to see it oh my god hold up fuck i know this is like schizophrenic right now but 
I, I, I didn't know how to line anything up, so I just Feel kind of... free to keep going, keep going schizophrenic. I had to go eat dinner. Oh, damn. Or I had to go get dinner. I also like that these are supposed to be beams, but I placed a glass texture on the bottom of them. Because, you know, glass is really known for holding stuff up. Alright. Of course. So, getting back into the loop. So, this is the loop. You can see that I was starting to do a little bit more in the way of... Oh, no! <laughs> oh, there's error models, too. Nothing but the finest. You could tell how many textures seriously got lost. But at this point, I had a little bit more of an inkling of what the outside of the building should look like. Um, these were supposed to be beams that I apparently... Uh, this is the security guard's desk, and I put a suit charger behind it because I was starting to think about gameplay. You know, black man tapping head gif. Uh, I got rid of the glass here. Oh, man. These... I've used... Oh, you know what this is, actually? I think I used a lot of uh, CS source textures in this. That might be why it's uh, it's not quite working. So this was this was supposed to be like the guidance office or the regular office or whatever. And I just was like putting shotguns and stuff. And this is a grenade cache. Or actually, this is an ammo cache. That would be a little concerning. <laughs> I don't know why. We, like, literally just have, like, shotguns and stuff behind all the desks. You know, just in case. These are supposed to be computers. I know for a fact these are actually the CS Source computers. And this was actually my first little attempt at modeling stuff because I was replacing the textures of them with, uh, mm. like, I placed the... <laughs> at this point, I think I already knew that people were having problems with uh, what I was doing. I don't know what that's about, but okay. Um, so I replaced... Uh, I replaced... The, I had a motivational poster, like the motivational posters you have in office. I had one of them hanging up. Uh, and I don't even remember what the, the, the I, I don't even remember what it said for the most part, but it was just, it was just something like, it was something about me getting investigated by the school for asking about that floor plan. Uh, and the computers all were retextured, so the screen had Half-Life 2 deathmatch on them. It was pretty great. So you have these super long really windows that are just terrible. These are lockers. Oh, I remember being so hyped that the lockers ended up working. And there's like ammo and stuff that you could take out of the lockers. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's so funny. I was so hype about this, too. Oh, that... Just... <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> fucking God, it's just brick. The fucking brick locker. It is just nothing but brick, because I don't have the locker texture anymore. Long gone. What happened to him? Oh, I deleted all of my stuff. Uh, this was like a... Yeah, this is ages ago, dude. Um, so this was finally something of the courtyard, a little bit of forbearing, you can see that I have a, a second floor window, uh, up there. Uh, but this is a little bit of courtyard, I was finally getting onto some curves, I was starting to really start to... What? I mean, like, for the time that you made it. Yeah. Like... I think the third one is actually better than either of these, and this is supposed to be a classroom. By this point, I was finally coming around to the fact that I could not feasibly fit within the scale of the game world uh, the ultra-detailed level that I had in my head. So I started to simplify it down. So all of those classrooms that you saw were gone. I just ended up keeping this one. This was supposed to be uh, someone's office that you could actually break into by smashing the glass. And then over here, I think this was the last thing that I implemented. Yes. All right. I'm not going to spoil that for right now. Uh, I have... I have this little outside area with just nothing but watermelons. Oh yeah, no, without a doubt. But the thing is, it's all like combine soldiers and stuff. That's the thing. It's not like this is a, uh, my argument at the time was like, well, I'm not shooting real people. It's like resistance members and like alien soldiers. So it's okay. That, that did not fly. But anyway, so I have watermelons and just like. Uh, it's still not great, but you're starting to see it to start to take shape a little bit. More of these lockers. More of these lockers. Um, another classroom. And this was finally the time that I started to add an upstairs. So I was working on uh, an upstairs that people could come and visit. Uh, and most of it was, again, just kind of like, you know, up and around hallways and stuff. Although I do think I was starting to actually put in classrooms uh, on the top floor. 
Um, so yeah, there's two classrooms here. I finally, finally put bezels on some of these. I remember being really proud of those. Um, and I guess I'm not actually going to find it. So what I'm going to do instead is just no clip into it. Uh, this is supposed to be a security office with a rocket launcher. And the rocket launcher never sat in here properly, so. So it just fucking, it fucking drops? Yeah, so it just drops onto the console, uh, which was supposed to be, this was supposed to be a TV screen, actually. Let's see if it works. It works! It actually does! I it does? I'm really, really proud of this. This is, uh, like a really bad TV screen where you can actually watch other people in the, in the level. Uh, like Half-Life 2 does its cameras. That's actually awesome. <laughs> so, I was starting to really get creative with this. I was really starting to get creative with like, all right, well, where, how am I going to fit weapons into it? How am I going to fit in, uh, you know, it, an element of strategy into it? And I think I wanted to have uh, ducts that people could actually drop into the security office with. In fact, I'm pretty sure that if you no clip around, this might be in the next build. I'm not sure, uh, but I remember adding in some capacity vents to this. So that way people could actually climb into the security office. And uh, that was supposed, supposed to be your, your reward for searching uh, is having a rocket launcher and being able to dominate the, the entire level. And I guess I even had a ladder so you could get up onto the top floor. Maybe that was how you got into it. I'm not sure. Uh, but either way. So things were really starting to take shape here. And uh, school officials were really starting to not like it. But too bad for them because we still got two more builds to go through. So, the next build that I'm going to share with you is... I'm not sure if this is also junior high, or if this is actually the high school. Because it's about the size of proto-school. Okay, so this is starting to be the junior... This is starting to be the actual high school. So, this was about the time that I had graduated and, and you know, actually got into high school. And, uh, thankfully, this took a whole lot less time to build. Um, and this was also about the time that I had, you know, I wasn't just trying to texture with random half-life textures right away. Um, but I was actually using developer textures. So hopefully we don't have any missing textures here. Um, so DM school test, it was called, or old. I think it was called old. Yeah, old. Excellent. Here we go. Oh, we're not totally free of the missing textures, but that's okay. So this was where I was really starting to get a little bit, a lot more detailed with my, my trims and uh, all of my developer textures and stuff. This was a whiteboard. Um, and I, I, like I said, I literally took pictures of whiteboards. Uh, and so that way I could have them be, you know, accurate. I didn't want to just rely on DM or uh, uh, CS office textures the entire time. But really starting to, really starting to get into them. I'm really starting to get into the details of things. Having a desk. Uh, There's a hallway. These were, I think, another... Oh, this is supposed to be a display case. I remember, I think I wanted to have props in the display case that you could actually pick up with your gravity gun and throw at people. So, uh, there we go. There's a whiteboard that's not broken. Um, this was really just a quick test of things, which is why it's not especially big. Uh... Oh man, did this leak? Oh, I think the map leaked. I don't even think I had this one uh, properly sealed. Just shows you how <laughs> much of a test it was, honestly. Um, this one's really good. Here, hold up. I'm gonna geo Especially clear. Especially just for a test map, this is great. Um, and the high school, like I said, because this was uh, you know, a much more interesting laid out school. I started to have, like, there were these stairs you could go down, but there were also these ramps. And I still didn't quite know how to do the zigzaggy ramps that they had in person. Just wait until the next build. Um, but I, I, I implemented that here. I remember playing with smoothing groups on um, on this, so it was uh, a little bit more, uh, like, the, 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 uh, the lighting wasn't as faceted looking, I suppose. And then the big thing here was the library. So this was the high school library that I had built. And I, this is actually still pretty good, not going to lie. Um, where It's fucking great. Uh, it had the actual windows. This is the librarian's desk. Uh, literally, this is the exact spot where kids would come and take their books back. Um, and then there was this office back here that uh, I remember. What was his name? Uh, Mr. Lowenberg, I think. 
I had such I had a lot of great conversations with him. That's great. I didn't get around to texturing it just yet. This was literally just a test. But uh, you know, I had like I had the wires that you know allowed these to hang from the ceiling. Uh, I didn't have lighting at this point. Mm. Uh, but yeah, this was properly like detailed and stuff, and I was like, I was onto something, and then I just never finished it. But the final build of the map is actually going to be uh, the most impressive because this is this was right. This was 2016, so this is about a year before I started VDU. This is about a year before I got into the Quake scene. So this was already like a good five years into me making levels. And it was called just simply BM School. Uh, this was supposed to be the definitive version of the map. And I gave up on it when I realized that it was just slightly too small. But you can tell because this is the second largest of the map. So this actually has a ton of detail in it. So I'm going to just, like I said, I'm not going to show you it in the editor. Just going to compile it real quick. And... It's going to be good. It's going to be real good. I don't know if I did lighting for this just yet. Lighting. But it's taking a little bit of time to viz. So I guess I had a particularly demanding brush level or a brush setup of some sort. How long have we been going for? An hour and a half. All right, we're done. All right. So the penultimate school. I think I'm back, actually. All right, so getting right right into this, right? Um, yeah. So I, like I said, I was really focused on just making sure the layout was good. So you could see that it's a little bit less detailed, but in some ways it's actually more detailed. Um, man, there's really no lighting in any of this. So this was literally, quite literally, the the uh, the uh, the layout that they had for the staircases and stuff and the ramps, which I would always walk up the ramps because I was cool and different. Um, that, yeah, do you see how crazy Borb's going? This is how good I got it. This is how good I got this level. Um, so, I remember there was, uh, this room right here, these little smaller side classrooms. I brought back the lockers. I brought back the lockers, uh, which, <laughs> there was a revolver in the locker. Wait, what? There was a revolver in the locker. That's, that's, that's in incredibly poor taste. Oh my god. That's funny. God. Here, hold yeah. on. Let me see if I can find yeah, I really it. See... Whoops. I want to see if I can get assault rifle or something in there. Man, hold on. Hold up. Where? These are all opening inwards. But. You know anybody, any old There we go. Look, there we go. The Revolver. Revolver in the locker. There you go. In oh, the best god. taste. You know any old person who saw those crossbow bolts? But immediately assume that that's dynamite. Yeah. So be like, hey, yeah. Fucking blowing up the school. Yeah, yeah. That's that's how they reacted. Um. So I have uh more ammo in the lockers, which is nice. Oh my god. <laughs> of course, you got health and stuff in the lockers too. Um. Another revolver, nice. Uh. I was starting to get the classrooms a little bit more detailed. Uh. This is the big. Oh my god, Borb. Just, I'm just going to let Borb look at this, and I just want to show you her reaction to this. Because this is so incredibly... This is the uh, the entrance area um, where... This was actually right around the time... This is the, this is the area that I had to go into for her graduation, because I was at her graduation. I had all of these windows up here, which you can shoot individually because I wanted mass chaos. Um... Don't worry, Borb. We haven't even gotten to the second level yet. So, we go up these stairs. Yeah, this is the auditorium entrance. Absolutely. Um, this was this was quite literally the overhang that they had, uh, looking over the auditorium entrance. Ah, uh, and I never quite finished the top level, but I had the stairs. Uh, you know, for stair, stair purposes. And this was the better version, or this was my more improved version of the library. Uh, I relocated, because like I said, I knew that I wasn't going to be able to fit this into a deathmatch map accurately, so I was taking liberties. So I put the desk over here instead. These were supposed to be bookshelves. Um, 
I, I, I really like, they really like that grid kind of texture, so I, or uh, the windows, so I, I kept that. Um, those are supposed to be bathrooms, I think. And then, they really did like the grid windows. And then this was the auditorium, or not the auditorium, this was the gym. So I probably would have put in more roller mines and basketball hoops and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I, I quite, I really never finished it outside of that. But I was really proud of how, like, the auditorium entrance actually came out. But the problem was that it was just slightly too small. I had actually, because my problem was that the textures, or the, uh, the, the, the brushwork that I was using was slightly too big. Um for all of the other ones so as you could see like i was using these developer textures uh to try and really get uh, the dimensions of this correct you know so like these are 64 and i really wasn't trying to just cut the textures wherever i was really trying to get stuff good uh you could see that these stairs for example they're the one grid block high so i was really really trying to get this uh as good as i could uh, and then the scale ended up being slightly too small for my liking, and I just never continued it. Um, but either way, this was the last ditch effort of making the school in Half-Life Deathmatch. And uh, this would have been where the courtyard went for the, the high school, this area right here. And then right over here would have been uh, the lunchroom and it was just it was turning out pretty neat it was and then i just sort of stopped working on it and probably for the best because like i said they were getting incredibly suspicious at this point and i just was like i'm just making levels for games man but i guess they were thinking i was trying to make like a murder simulator or some shit but yeah there you go that's that's the story of dm school and showing you all the stuff from dm school yeah um so we're already at the two hour mark <laughs> you are yeah you you are glitching out a lot dude I feel like this would if you want to this probably could put the end on I, this is awful I would end on it. Oh man, my my uh my download folder got filled with uh stuff. Whoops. Um. But I I figured. I don't know. You guys tired of my voice yet? Do you guys want to hear me read a really ob a obscene and insane story from ages ago? Um, because. All right, Yoshi wants me to read the story. Um, Cabby, do you want me to read Sex with Satan? No, I don't think it is what you think it is, Board, but trust me, it is fantastic. I've already shown Cabby it. It's called Sex with Satan, and I found it on text files. It is very old. It is very, very funny. Not gonna lie. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Did I have... The entire... Did I have half my display cut off? Uh, while the stream was going? Because <laughs> now that's what it's showing up as. My bad if that's the case. Either way, uh, that's irrelevant now. Because it doesn't... You know, we're, we're over that part. But, you know. I do want to... I do want to... I do want to leave you guys with a bedtime story. And I figured this is probably... Probably a good one. Good one to... Good one to to finish off the stream with my first stream back i've been wanting to read this for ages and by the way if there's anything that you want me to do readings of on stream i'd like to do more of them because the one time that i had to read that leroy uh like blog post that was fantastic that was genuinely great so if you've got insane stuff you want me to read i will um and here you go here's exactly why you should the leroy post was so good so so good all right, uh, Griff had to leave, but that's okay, because uh, the infinite hourglass of guilt. So good. So good. Oh, Cabby already knows. Cabby already knows.
Let me just tell Griff. Uh, let me acknowledge him. So, probably already got a little bit of an idea. Um, so we're gonna be. It's gonna. It's a story called "Sex with Satan," and I swear to God, this is a real text file that was passed around on BBSs back in the '80s or so. In fact, let me see if this is dated. Nope, it is not dated whatsoever. It is brought to you by a man named Psycho. I do want to read it. BBS, their bulletin board systems. Uh, Griff, Griff said I loved being on. I hope next time we do it, I don't randomly uh, accuse people of being sex offenders. Hopefully so. Either way, this is called Sex with Satan by Psycho. And it's a real text file, and I'm not going to do any more preamble. I'm just going to read it, because you people need to experience it. Yes, I do want to. I would have loved if this was on PBS. Imagine me just sitting there in, like, tasteful clothes. Like, a, like, a, like, a, like one of the guys sitting in a, in a chair with a pipe and just reading this to the camera. Um... That's, that's what I want you to imagine as we read this. So first of all, this file is dedicated to my late dog, Cindy, who without her influence, this file would never have been possible. This file contains explicit sexual material, so don't jack off on the keyboard. My life had been very, I'm sorry, hold on. <clears throat> my life had been very boring and drab. My subscription at Penthouse and National Lampoon were about to expire, so my life had no meaning. I had been working mowing lawns, trying to get enough money to buy a hard drive, since my ex-girlfriend told me that hard things were nicer than floppy ones. My parents were in California for US 84. My dad posted a note on the local college job board that he needed a babysitter to watch his 15-year-old son and sit by the pool and suntan. We got so many phone calls. My babysitter's name was known to me only as 342433. You need music. Does somebody want to get me something absolutely insane? Or something, you know, really pleasant. Uh, I don't know, something something piano, maybe. Because I certainly I certainly am not gonna find anything right now. I'm not playing that. Jake Jake. Jake. I'm not playing that. I'm not reading that. I'm not I'm not playing that. Not on stream. Absolutely not. No, I'm not. It is not gonna happen. I don't know. Maybe I'll go looking for something. Something by Kevin McLeod. Incompetech time. Something shitty and overplayed. Okay, I will do that. I will I will play something from the man himself, Kevin McLeod. Um So let's see here. I'm looking for something. I'm not I'm not playing 009 sound system, no, absolutely not. Um Pizza Song Spider Man. That sounds kind of actually that I I don't know, maybe. Uh, let's let's let, let me check through some of these real quick. Hold on. Everybody seems to really really want. Uh... Yeah, I got the I got the DMs. Yes. Um, everybody seems to want me to. Uh, All right, well, let's go looking for some music real quick, right? Um, do, do people really want me to play the Spider-Man pizza theme? Yoshi says it doesn't need to be out. That's a little loud. I'm not playing this. I'm sorry. I am not playing this with my story. Actually, you know, maybe maybe I should. 
10 hour tasteful restaurant pia if you want to send me the link we could do it i feel like i feel like trust me you need the mood set for you and if if we just do something absolutely ridiculous i mean doing your mom is slap core but we're not playing that one we need the mood to be set all right you kids have no taste in a in a in a tasteful atmosphere so we trust me Your R have no taste. All right, let's do it. No. No. You did not just... Ah, uh, YouTube. God. All good. All good. All right, let's get this over here. Something went wrong? Oh. There we go. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. Let's just let's just let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. So getting back to this. This is classy. You need trust me, you want classy music with this. I promise you. All right. My first days since my the first days of my stay alone with the star of Debbie Does Dallas was pretty boring since it was that time of the month and I am not a vampire. The third day of my stay, my babysitter sat down and told me that she had fantasies of molesting young 15-year-old boys who she babysits for. She then proceeded to fulfill our fate by sticking her soft hands down my pants and unzipping me. She took off her shirt and bra, slacks and panties, and then leaned over and told me she wanted to whisper sweet nothings in my rear. She told me she had seen this in a Cheech and Chong movie. I naturally went along with the fantasy. As she took off my pants and placed my joint into her vibrating mouth. She took off my pants and placed my joint into her vibrating mouth. <laughs> Nothing good's gonna come of it, but I'm going to read it anyway because I've really, really wanted to read this. So, enjoy the story time, asshole. <laughs> As she began to choke, she turned her head up and told me that she had one more fantasy to fulfill with me. I said that I would do anything for her. She tied me to the bed with these handcuffs she had ripped off a fucking cop. She proceeded to spank me and kept calling me bad boy. Then, the little nympho took out a lighter and set my cock on fire and told me not to smoke. As I began to burn, I could faintly see her molesting my pet gerbil while smoking a banana peel, which happened to be my pecker. I saw a violent light, then a rainbow in the dark. I was dead and in heaven. I, being an active atheist, didn't believe a damn thing about this. I saw some gates and opened them and proceeded to go through the bars. A man with a cane stopped me and told me he could answer any questions I had about heaven. I proceeded to ask, Sir, if I lived a good life and kept kosher, helped little old ladies across the street, do you think I could get a cute little angel to piss on my face every Thursday night in heaven? <laughs> <clears throat> the man immediately hit me in the balls with the cane and said, There is no sex or corruption in heaven. We all sit around and meditate while listening to culture club tapes. I said, Fuck this shit, man. I absolutely do not want to spend my eternity in this fag joint. I then left the gates and jumped into oblivion through the clouds. I fell through the sky and felt the earth seal around me. I began to hear some faint music. I ran towards the music and heard some Ozzy Osbourne crazy train playing. I immediately screamed, now this is more fucking like it. I took out my pack of menthol players and lit it from the fire still protruding from my cock. A lady with extremely large breasts welcomed me into my new home. I saw men orging in the fire-laden streets with beautiful women. I jumped on a 21-year-old woman and started gangbanging her with my cock of fire. She stood up and screamed, why is your cock on fire? I told her my plight, and she told me to go to Satan's wife. I entered Satan's wife house and signed the guest register. I ran up to her room, where she was actively masturbating with a broomstick. I said, wow, wow. She looked up in ecstasy and asked me what she could do for me. I blushed. She said, besides that. I told her of my story. She, she said she could help me quench the fires, but I would have to pledge my life to winning over the virginity of young schoolgirls. She placed my cock in her mouth, and the fire was quenched by our ecstasy. I asked her what her name was with my, in my last breath of passion. 
She said it was Lita Ford. I asked her if the lady who set my cock on fire back on Earth was one of her followers. She said her name was Wendy O. Williams. I said, wow! After having another engagement of oral sex with her steaming clit, I was whisked away to the land of virginity and high school girls. I found myself in a private school for young, rich, snobby girls. My new identity was Angus. I had no last name, but never questioned the intent of my master's wife. I first began to, notice, I first began to hunt out my prey with the high school cheerleaders, but after noticing that they stuck to the floor while doing the splits, I decided to go for less virtile girls. I seduced a young girl whose face reminded me of an ancient memory. I took her up to my apartment and she said she needed help with her geometry. I showed her my obtuse angle and she showed me her acute one. As I tore off her bra, I noticed how underdeveloped she was. I took off her greasy panties and began to townge her love channel. She started to moan and she said she couldn't believe I was doing that to her. I told her just to sit back and relax. As I licked her wet spot, I noticed her- <laughs> This is actually getting kind of- Oof, I don't know about this. That's okay. As I licked her wet spot. <laughs> oh no! Uh, I noticed her erect nipples. And the tiny dew drops forming around her clit. I townge fucked her for 15 minutes, then started to push my shaft up her. My face is starting to hurt, not gonna lie. <sighs> she started to moan with pleasure. I proceeded to tie her to the bed with a pair of hot handcuffs which I had borrowed from Wendy. I forced my victim's head down over my pulsating dong. She began to gag a familiar gag. I let her, hair, her head up for air for a moment, and then to my surprise, she stuck out her tongue, her tonge out, and it was flaming. I said, oh shit, not again. She set my deck on fire. As I proceeded to go back to my mistress in the underworld of sex, I began to think of how cool it would feel to get my pecker's fire quenched again by Satan's, wife cool, Satan's wife's cool, pulsating tonge. I entered hell for a second time, and everybody greeted me with praises and started begging for sexual vibrators to be sold in hell for a lower price. I said, why ask me? They told me it was all a test to see who would be the new number two. I began to understand, as I remembered the ancient lyrics of an Iron Maiden song named The Prisoner. I lit another player's and proceeded to my master's flaming house in the depths of sex. I entered, and Satan bowed down and kissed my hand. He said I am the new number two since he is getting a little too old to get his cock sucked on anymore by his wife. I took the position gladly. I realized my new position. I am Satan. I have unlimited powers. I begin to lead unsuspecting virgin girls to my domain. I conquer earth with my flaming nymphos. I proceed to climb up to the ladder of heaven and gangbang all the ladies there and say, you could have been doing this all your life instead of living in misery, trying to draft more people into your false faith. I then pick up my brand new electric Gibson Challenger with new tremolo bar and customized locking bolts with the perfect distortion. I yelled the ancient and foreshadowing lyrics of my coming into power. Heavens on fire. This is my life and this is my story. The next man you see caught on fire could be me predicting my rule overall and the sexual reign on earth, hell, and heaven. Psycho. The keeper of the cock of fire. Death to all prudes and non-sexual pussy rockers. I am in power. Don't fuck with this file or someday I may go up and fuck your eight-year-old daughter and make her a prostitute of my reign on 42nd Street. Brought to you by the ASCII assassin. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I'm glad you all enjoyed it. And I'm telling you, I want to do more like it. I want to read for you bedtime stories. I, I think it's fair. Anyway, <clears throat> we've been going for, what, how long now? Almost two hours. <laughs> is this what people mean when they say they miss the old internet? Yes. Yes, they do. This is exactly what they mean. Um... 
but you know i figure it's, it's probably a good time to to pack it in we had a good time back we enjoyed ourselves we played a little bit we listened to griff be griff we, we we read a bedtime story it was good it was a good time and i'd like to thank you all once again for coming out you know hoping to do more like this now that you know i'm feeling feeling a little bit better um i don't know frankly i wasn't expecting to read half of that but i did um i don't know so it's, it's it's a weird it's a weird feeling it really is but uh Anyway, I am Marito, as always, and what's my, what's my catchphrase again? I don't remember. I'm sure it's something.